Hey, are you... <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, I've had fun hanging out with you tonight, but you, um... Seem a little bit, you know, what's the stuff of it? You're drunk. You're really drunk. So, uh... Maybe we should, you know, call you a cab or something, get you home safe. Yeah, I'm sure you can want any time you quit, but that's not the point. The point is that, you know, I just want to make sure you go home safely. So that when I call you tomorrow, probably tomorrow, late afternoon, evening, maybe the next day, considering how you're swaying right now, <laughs> that it's, you know, I'm not fooling someone who never made it home. Just want you to be safe, that's all. You don't want to go in a cab. Okay. Would you prefer a hot air balloon? A Zeppelin, maybe? Carry you? What? Excuse me, what kind of... You think I'm just some sort of lumbering doofus who's going to carry you home? Like one of these kind of anime kids where you, you hang off my neck and point in a certain direction with a big smile and I'm just supposed to go, oh, okay, and lumber off. Oh, God, I'm really going to go with the please. Please, will you keep... Oh, fine, fine, fine. I said fine, don't, no, don't... I'm most certainly not carrying you whenever you want. This is a one-time deal. So, you know, sober up. Sober up enough to enjoy it. Because this is not going to be a routine. <sighs> yeah, so if I carry... How long... How far away do you live from here? I just realized I might be volunteering you to carry... I, I'm not. Five minutes. Okay, that I can do. If you lived, you know, in the next state, that might have been difficult. <laughs> well, you know, to quote my favorite manly man ever, Zach Brannigan, please, the, <laughs> the mind is willing, but the flesh is weak. I think it's weak. Is that the quote? Something like that. Or maybe the flesh is something and something, whatever. Point is, you know. Would I carry you home to the next day in a fancy land? Sure. Can I actually do it? Yeah, I need some food and water and help. Anyway, come on, let's go. Oh, for the love of God. It's... Oh, I mean, this way as well, just get called a storm. I'm assuming there's no way I can convince you into a taxi right now. Oh god, the pouting. Can you at least, you know, make sure that my jacket hood stays over my head? Well, it's more like don't pull it back or something like that. Y yeah. Yes, I know I'm a manly man. Thank you for that reassurance. Because previously the offer to carry someone home has, you know, really dampened my confidence in the masculinity which I clearly radiate. Come on. Yeah, you don't have to jump. I can bend down. Just put your legs forward and stop laughing before I change my mind. What am I doing? It's a piggyback. What, you think I was going to carry you like a kind of wedding thing over the threshold the whole way or like a sack of potatoes? This is at least the most logical way to do this. Now, come on. Up. <sighs> okay. There we go. Huh. See? This isn't too bad. Now, where am I going? Okay. Uh, if you want me to do this, you're going to have to rephrase that. I am not your stallion. And I am most certainly not being kicked as if I'm a racehorse. Okay, 
you can just about point just to show me where I'm going. I'll just about accept that as you giggle. But for the most part, this is going to be... Uh, I don't know. I, uh, whatever, just point me in the right direction, would you? Uh, I'll live to regret this. You know, here's a random thought just popped into my head. This is the most muggable I'll ever be in my life. It's not as that like I can run away or react or something. Some guy runs up to me, give me your wallet, what am I going to do? Alright, hold on, just wait till I put them down first and then I'm coming at you. Yeah, it doesn't really work, does it? <sighs> yes, I'm, you can stop whispering in my ear that I'm a manly man and giggling. It, uh... Yeah, just, yeah. Yes, you need to hold on. Right. You're enjoying this far too much. Hmm? Go down this way? Go down this way? Um. No. What? It's a shortcut. Okay, that way... Looks like a shortcut to my kidneys getting harvested. What do you mean? You seriously want me to... That is perhaps the most ominous looking dark street I have ever seen in my life. Surely there's a better way to go than that. Ow, I won't flick my ear. Seriously. Oh my god, I'm gonna be murdered. I'm gonna be murdered. Wonderful. Let's just get on with it. This is very safe. This is very sane. What am I doing with my life? What do you mean? Look, I'm carrying you home while looking, while walking down the scariest street in the world. And I'm doing it voluntarily. No one's holding me at gunpoint. I mean, yet yeah, it'll happen because this street is this street. I mean, Jack the Ripper would be quaking in his boots to walk down here. This is... Mm, what am I moaning at? I'm, I, I explained this already. Yeah, well, you get the fun piggyback ride and I actually have to do the carrying. And no, you're not heavy, it's just, you know... <laughs> As I said, this street is intimidating, to say the least. Nearly at the end of the part we're walking in. Well, that's something. We could maybe go somewhere that can afford the luxuries of a street light, for example. Ah, that way? Ah, that looks infinitely safer. So, with Sod's Law, that's where I'm getting. <laughs> that's why I'm getting violently attacked. Okay. So, remind me, why the hell am I carrying you again? Because I'm a manly man. Yeah, that was it. That's not going to be an explainer for everything. Or I find it's not going to get you away with everything. Because it's not. You can't just say, hey, you're, because you're such a manly man, please do thing X for me. I mean, just how stupid do you think I am? What? Why are you giggling? I'm carrying you home in the rain. <sighs> Annoyingly, it's quite hard to debate against that point. For God's sake. Yeah, yeah, giggle away. What? Don't worry, it'll be worth it. Uh, what does that mean? No, I'm not blushing. What? I just, well, yeah. what am I supposed to think that means apart from what that might mean? Look, can you just stop? Uh, no, I don't have to put you down. I can keep carrying you. It's only a few more minutes, right? We're fine. So strong, huh? Yes. 
At this point, I'm not even sure if you like me or if you're just here to irritate me. You like... Okay, you cannot... Okay, you cannot whisper into my ear that you like me like that. That is not... Acceptable. Oh, God. Why? Because... I also drank, and I'm trying to make it back to wherever the hell you live. And then get back to where the hell I live, if I can remember that. Huh? I'm not going anywhere. What, uh, okay, that has to be rephrased immediately. I'm... Staying at your place. Uh... Am I? That's news to me. Well... You have to make it up to me. That's... Very nice, but, um, yeah. Okay, how much giggling is there gonna be exactly today? I'm just so fun to tease. Oh, isn't that wonderful? Ah, no giggling. What else? What else would I expect to have happened there? <sighs> We're nearly there. Okay, cool. Well, uh,. Okay, that flat. Yeah, well, I hope you don't think I can levitate up to the window. We're gonna have to use the commoner's method of stairs, I'm afraid. Do you want me to carry you up the stairs, or... <laughs> you think you can walk up the stairs? Oh, well, I hope you're right. I guess I'll, you know... See you up to the apartment door. What do you mean, no, I... <sighs> okay, well, I can come inside for a bit, I guess. I Stop giggling at me. <sighs> yes, I'm shy. Because I don't... Do this. <laughs> Well, I, no, it's not that I haven't. It's just I don't, you know, I've just met you. Why is that hard to understand? I'm not a one night person. So. I mean, hell, I'll give you a fiver. You can remember my full name right now, the second. Yeah, exactly. And you're now five pounds less well off. Mwahahaha. What does that even mean? It means you lost five pounds of weight. No, you didn't. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about either. I'm just deflecting because, um. Because I'm not a one night guy. And. I like you. And I want to see you again. But I don't, I've never, you know, not the first night I've met someone. And I just kind of want to save it, you know, for when I know you better. Don't awe me. Yeah, of course, this is cute. <sighs> like, I just think that the act is, for me, you know, a culmination of feelings and not just a... I'm not saying other people don't get to enjoy it or whatever. Other people get to do what they want. I'm not other people. I'm me. And there's what I want. And, you know... It'd be nice if uh, that wasn't something that was so openly mocked. No, I, I don't... Well, I appreciate you saying sorry. It's not really that when you say sorry, it's just... <laughs> that I do really like you. And... I don't want it to be a one-time thing. 
that I want to take you out on dates. I want to take you out to bars and clubs and cafes and galleries and <laughs> parks and everything. And I want to be falling for you before I fall with you. <laughs> yeah, that joke sucked. I'm sorry. But uh, yeah, well, anyway. I'll tell you what, while I'm not going to go as long as you would like or stay as long as you would like, I can give you a little itty bitty preview. Yes, I'm sure I want to leave, or at the very least, not do that. At the very least, yeah. So I'll stay. Hmm. Hmm. Do I trust you? Do I think you shall try to tempt me? I'm not playing any games. But I guess I can platonically sleep over. Don't grin like that. I'm telling you right now, nothing's happening. I'm just saying, don't don't get your hopes up. If you think this is some sort of long plan for me to, you know, get you to try harder to you know, tempt me into doing stuff. That's not what this is. I'm really not doing it. I'm really not. So if that's what you're hoping for, please accept that it's not gonna happen. Just cuddles. I can do cuddles. I can do cuddles. <sighs> okay. Happy giggling. Lead on then. <laughs> <laughs> 